me looking out there. It should be a gorgeous day for a run. Yes, it'll be perfect. So the run gets started at 7 a.m. So right when it starts could be a little chilly, right? Upper 40s, but such a pleasant and dry day for the Portland Marathon as we get into the low 60s by noon. Checking in on the Dow's a lovely day out there. It's 70 degrees, pretty calm winds, at least for the gorge. Uh, out of the northwest right now, nine miles per hour. Making our way over to Mount Hood Meadows. Earlier this week, the top of Mount Hood Meadows getting some snow and low clouds have been hanging around today. We're at 43 degrees up there. Currently downtown Portland, some clouds in the mix for us, but we are in the upper 60s. So a pretty nice fall day if you've been out in the pumpkin patch or maybe go into a corn maze. Tonight, though, grab that jacket because we get down into the mid-50s by 11 tonight. So our daytime high unofficially at 69 degrees here in Portland, all the way down to Eugene as well. Normal for this time of year here in PDX is 72 degrees. It was just last Friday that we hit 79, okay? But over the last few days, yes, that's when we've seen those cooler temperatures. In the earlier forecast, I think I said that we were above normal. No, that was wishful thinking. We've been below our normal high for this time of year, looking at the low 60s. As we time this out for you tonight, we have those clear skies and we'll be in the mid 50s throughout our evening. Going into tomorrow morning, a little bit cooler for us, but a sunny Sunday expected. Those clouds don't start rolling in until late Sunday night into Monday morning. And then by the time we get into our late Monday morning, that's when we start to see some showers coming into the mix. Southwest Washington could see some heavier downpours. This is at 11 a.m. on Monday. So to start our Monday, a little wet with those scattered showers. By the time we get into the afternoon, though, mostly cloudy and we'll stay dry. Could see some lingering drizzle Tuesday morning at times, uh, but pretty dry for the rest of our Tuesday. All right, let's look at those rain chances. As we get into our week, that's when we see those scattered showers could linger into Tuesday morning. But then once we get to midweek and into late next week, we're staying dry. Here are the big takeaways as we check out the Hotel Indigo Kirkland Tower camera. Uh, big takeaways from our forecast in the immediate future. Plenty of sunshine this weekend. Chilly mornings, though, so grab those jackets and then the rain showers return Monday. Setting up our Sunday, though, a beautiful day on the coast once we get past that patchy fog. Tillamook daytime high tomorrow, looking at the mid 60s. Sun breaks in the afternoon all up and down our shoreline. And for the valley, sunshine for a good majority of Sunday as we all hover in the low 70s. So another beautiful day in store for us throughout the valley tomorrow as we now check in on our seven day forecast. Uh, quite a mix of temperatures there. Yes, we're in the low 70s tomorrow for the Portland Marathon uh, for our highs, but then Monday, cooler temps and rain showers. Tuesday, mid 60s, midweek. That's when we start to warm up and check out next Saturday, expecting to hover around 80 degrees. That's okay. Yeah, you know, we don't for mind October. it, but. Yeah, it, it is right? still feeling like fall. The leaves are falling when yes. I was playing flag football because that's all I could handle at this age. <laughs> Perfect.